All right, you guys, on this episode, we're going fishing with Jason Arman, and he's a wade fishing expert. What's the target species today? Uh, targeted species is gonna be trout and redfish in the Indian River Lagoon. Now, I've never caught a trout before. How do they fight? Uh, they can fight really good. Some of my biggest trout ever have fought like snook, and until they got right in front of me, I didn't even know what I had. So that sounds exciting. And we got some redfish, we can get some snook. Maybe a few jacks. Yeah, all kinds of stuff are out here. We're definitely gonna have a multi-species day. Man, look at all these rusted pipes here. This is make a good artificial reef out there. So this is the gear we're gonna be using. Some light spinner reels, light braid, and a light action rod. Yep. So Jason, how long have you been wade fishing for? Uh, this area, probably over 20 years. I have a lot of experience on the Indian River Lagoon doing a lot of wade fishing. I started off doing, you know, live bait fishing and realized there was more to fishing than that and started using the lures like these bass assassins. Mm -hmm. And uh, as you're going to see, they uh, very productive lure. Sounds good. All right, we're going into the hole here. Deep into the mangroves here. Spider swat. Are there big spiders here? Possibly. What kind of spiders? Bananas? Uh, you're joking right now, right? Absolutely not. Okay, guys, we got some gnarly spiders. So start swatting everywhere. Oh, look at that spider right there. We don't want. We don't want him. You know, keep going. He's right in front of you. We gotta whack him. Oh, wait. I don't see him. Oh, yeah, I, I see him. Right crawl there. On you. Definitely don't let him crawl. Start swatting here, guys. All right, we got out of the mangrove. Whatever you call that. All right, so you start casting or? Now, uh, what kind of retrie what, what kind of retriever are you doing? Fast, slow. A little on the slow side. You want to gather up your slack when it lands, and then kind of slow down. Little double you said, jig. You said you've been getting hit through the middle. Very of the important ball. to keep your rod up and kind of still. Oh yeah. You don't want to move it a lot because then you're going to change it in the water column. So you want to keep it swimming very steady. So Jason, are you still looking for your first redfish? So I am, been into our fishing for probably about two years now, just you know, really trying to get my first redfish. Uh, caught trout, jack, snook, but that redfish has seemed to have been elusive for me so far, unfortunately. Hopefully we get them today. I'll get my first trout, you get your first redfish. Everyone's happy. Are there any surprise species that might happen? Man, you ever met mangrove man? No. Mangrove man's weird, bro. Really? Very weird. So who's Mangrove Man? Mangrove Man lives in the mangrove, and every so often he comes out, What's says like hello. Are you the Mangrove Man? I'm not the Mangrove Tell Man. Tell the truth, Jason. Tell the but truth. But I have witnessed. I have witnessed him. So he does exist. There we go. Fish on. That's like a trout. Nice, nice trout. trout. All right. All right. Now you want to wet your hand. Guys, that's my first trout ever right there. See how he swallowed that bait? Look at that. That's a cool, cool fish right there. He's croaking. Gee, look at those little fangs right there. Fish on. Fish on. Another fish on. Nice. All right. Came off. Uh, Over here when you do that. Yep. Just kind of like roll it. Watch. Mm -hmm. Cool. Hey Sean, Jason's hooked We're up. In him. Oh, there he is. We're in the trout now. Triple header, come on, let's get him. Yeah. Nice. Hey Sean. Alright, that's awesome. We got a double. It feels oh. nice. Double header. Jeez. Nice. He's double jumping out of crazy. guys double header baby. double header trout in the indian river lagoon look at those spots on them look at the pretty fish man what a beautiful fish beautiful fish love it that cotton that cotton yellow mouth in there gobbling those up the bass assassin. 
Oh, nice mine just job, took off. Guys. It's a really nice fish, Jason. Nice fish. Good job, Josh. There we go, fish on. And because it worked. Oh, I got hit too. I got hit. I don't rock it. All right, doing his little head shakes. There he is, right there. Let's release this fish. Beautiful release. So the bite slowed down a little bit. We've, we caught four fish real fast and uh, we've been walking for about a couple hundred yards now and uh, no more bites. See this tree right here? This is our, our end spot and then we're gonna turn around and head back. So hopefully we can get a few more fish. Yeah. Fish on, fish on. Fish on, baby. Whoop. That's a nice trout, man. That's that, 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 that was a bass fishing hook set right there. Nice little that sea trout. Stay tight, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> get him, Grant. All right, let's get another one. There we go, fish on, fish on. Nice, nice. Small sea trout where I'm skipping them in and just out of nowhere with the most massive explosion. Eat the bass assassin. Nice little sea trout in the Indian River. There nice we go. sea trout, nothing crazy, but. Hey, really pretty uh, fish. Sun the iridescence in the fish up in here you can really see kind of the shine sometimes it's like purple pinkish purple but without a doubt the most beautiful fish in the Indian River so with these baits it's really important sometimes how you rig them and you want to look at the way the tail is shaped that's a really easy indication on how to rig it that would be upside down and that would be right side up. So when you're looking at a paddle tail, you really want to know which is the top and bottom. So when you're rigging your bait, go in the front, just kind of feed it down, keep it right in the middle. And that way when it's swimming in the water, it's gonna ride really, really <laughs> level. And it's not gonna wanna, it's not gonna wanna, you know, fall over. We had a really fun morning waiting. I've never done this before. Caught my first trout ever. Can't thank Jason Ramon enough for putting us on a fish. It's a really good day. Thank you very much for coming out here. What's the name of your services? Uh, that's our man, Lamb Base Fishing on Facebook, or that's our man on Instagram. Search me uh, on Google or come along the Treasure Coast and you'll find me somewhere. Awesome, awesome. And I can't thank Jason Alongo enough from Southern Fin Apparel. He's the one that introduced me to Jason Armand and um, had a, Jason, had a blast fishing you guys today. Thank you. Great yeah, time. Yeah, it was a good time. And guys, don't forget, Jason has a free buff promotion. So make sure you click the link in the description. Free buff, all you have to do is click the link. We'll see you guys next time.